Hi friends, you are welcome to this presentation. This is Soft Reason. In this presentation, I will be demonstrating how to configure Protas Structure 2021 to design single reinforced footing using this double columns time stamp. Alright, so this structure has been analyzed and designed successfully. If I should navigate to the drawing and report area, I click right away and then select part best this there. Alright, you will notice that this is a double reinforced footing. And so what we are going to be doing is how we can design a single reinforced footing. Because if you go by this double reinforced footing, it is a waste of material. Alright? And Protar Structure 21 can configure single reinforced footing. So let's proceed. I will have to close this right away. And then if I should select on the foundation, right click, and then click on the property of this foundation. Part 40. I come to the 3D. And then I left click. Sorry. I right click hold and then rotate this. This way. Rotate it again. You can see this is a double F force 40. Which is the drawing we add over there. So I'll have to close this right away. I'll come to the web. And I will remove this foundation. I'll select it. Hold the control key, select the next one so as to delete it. Right click and then select delete. Okay, to delete that. Then I will navigate to the plan view of the foundation level. After which I will go to building setup. And I'll come to settings. In the drop down menu, I'll select settings center. In this options dialog, I will navigate to foundation. Okay, in the foundation provisions, I will navigate to Steva sections. In this provision, I will uncheck this top bars, uncheck that, this and this one. After getting these three provisions uncheck, click on OK. Then you will have to save the project first. Unchecking those things simply means, unchecking those provisions simply means you have removed the top bar. You are now going to be working with only the button bar in the X direction and as well in the Y direction. Okay, so just click on save to save that effect. Alright, so having that effect saved, what you just need to do is you just have to insert the part footing again by selecting the column at the foundation level, right click and then click on insert part footing. Alright, so this has been designed successfully, so you just have to check for punching, share, and ordinance we checking if they have passed the design. Okay, as you can see, everything has passed. Now go to 3D now, click on the 3D view. So right click on the object and then rotate it now. Zoom it in such a way that you can see it very well. So this is now a single reinforced footing. You can see, so you have to click on design again to ensure that all the necessary check has passed the design. After which, click on OK to insert the single reinforced part footing. The same thing is applicable to this second column. If you go to 3D and check that out, you will notice that it is a now single reinforced part footing. Design it. And ensure all the necessary check as passed, after which click on OK. So we have successfully configured the Protar Structure 2021 to design single reinforced part footing. If you want to check for the drawings of these footings, navigate to the drawings and reports. In this tab, click on Part Base Detail. And here we have this. You can see now, this is a single reinforced part footing okay so this is how to design single reinforced part footing using protest structure 2021 the same thing is applicable to your design you can also check that out and it works effectively 
Once again, you are welcome. Bye for now.